Hey there, I am so excited to join you on your journey in praying through the Lord's Prayer. This guide is designed to take us through each part of the Lord's Prayer, showing us how to pray the way Jesus instructed. One day Jesus was praying in a certain place, and when he finished, one of his disciples said to him, Lord, teach us to pray. And Jesus said to him, Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. So what we're going to do today is we're going to focus on praying his agenda first. Jesus said this, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Part of being a child of God is caring about what he cares about loving who he loves. We know his will is perfect and we acknowledge his wisdom and sovereignty when we pray his agenda first. Luke chapter 12 verse 31 says this, he will always give you all you need from day to day if you make the kingdom of God your primary concern. So we're going to spend some time focusing on what God focuses on. His priorities include things like this, saving the lost, wisdom and guidance for those in authority. That includes parental, spiritual, governmental, work-related authorities. Caring for the poor and the marginalized. Praying for unity and love in our families, in our communities, in our churches. Praying for justice, freedom for those in bondage, and praying that his, his will is accomplished and his purpose is accomplished in our lives. I invite you to pray a prayer like this. God, I recognize there is no better plan on earth than yours. And I pray for your will to be done in my life and in our world. This world is lost and needs you desperately. And I pray for every person to know you as their personal Lord and Savior. I pray for the leaders in my life that you would show them your will and give them supernatural wisdom and discernment as they lead. God, I pray that your heart for justice and unity would be seen in our world that those who are in bondage will be set free and that the needs of the poor and the marginalized will be met. Show me my role in seeing the realities of heaven come to earth. Make your priorities my priorities. Help me love who you love and see value in all people. I give you my life and, and I have it your way in me. Please give me wisdom and clarity as you show me the next steps. Well, church, we want to thank you again for the opportunity that you joined us in our journey of prayer through the Lord's Prayer. We're excited for what God's going to do in your life.